Hey everyone, so today I wanted to do the nail polish tag because just like I'm sure a lot of you guys, I am addicted to nail polish and I don't know why, I just, I love buying it and I love wearing it. <laughs> so I have the questions in front of me and um, this is a tag video, I wasn't tagged but I will tag people below in the description box. Number one, what is your favorite nail polish company? I would say Essie because I love neutral polishes and I love like a cream finish um, and I just think they have a really pretty range. Number two, glitter or no glitter? No glitter. I, I just don't really like it. I have kind of like short fingernails and so um, I just don't think it looks that good on my hand. So I just, I don't prefer it. I do own a few of them, but I think I just got caught up in buying them. But if I were to choose my favorite type of glitter polish, and this isn't even a glitter, this just is a really sparkly one, but it would be Rage by Orly. OPI China Glaze or Essie? Well, I kind of already mentioned that, but I would say Essie, although of course I do like the other two brands. So I'd say OPI does the best with like the names, cute names, and the brighter, deeper colors. And then I would say China Glaze is really good with trends, you know, with the whole shatter nail polishes, the glitter, and the kind of like deeper browns type colors. I think they're really good with the trendier colors. And I think Essie is just really good for your go-to everyday polishes. Number four, when do you change your nail polish? Now, I used to change it like all the time because I am not amazing at painting my nails. I don't know, I just prefer to get them done. So lately, I've just decided that it's worth it for me to instead of continue to buy all these nail polishes, I have told myself that I will stop and I'll just get a manicure a week. So that's kind of what I've been doing. And I also have really like dry cuticles, so it's kind of important for me to be able to keep my hands in good shape and a manicure just really helps me do that because I'm really bad at picking at my cuticles. Number five, what's your favorite color on your nails? And I would definitely say like neutral white. Um, I only recently I started getting manicures in actual colors. I used to only get like the whites and the neutrals and I love mixing colors. I'll always bring over two colors and be like, I want this one and then put this one on top of it. I don't know why, I just kind of think it helps create your own color, so. Um, but definitely like neutrals, like I love when I'm tan and I have like a whitish light pink nail. Number six, darks or brights? I would definitely say brights, as in like neutral brights, but I do love like deep reds like Essie Wicked or um, Essie Carry On, I think it was called. Because I do have shorter nails, there are times when I think like their darker colors look better on the short nails. Um, but overall, definitely bright. Number seven, what are you wearing on your nails right at this moment? This is Essie Cocktail Bling, and this was a manicure that I got. Matte nails in or out? Um, I would say out. I actually do have this matte top coat by Butter London that my mom bought me because she thought it looked fun and it is fun. It just, it doesn't really work for me. If I like matte nails at all, I actually like matte neutral nails. Number nine, French manicure. I do think that French manicures chip a little bit easier so I don't typically get them also because my nails are really short but I do like them and I used to get them a lot. I'm not a huge fan of them on your toes. I've, I've maybe gotten it once. I don't know, it just kind of weirds me out. Number 10, favorite winter color. Um, probably like a deep red from Essie. I think I already mentioned Wicked. Uh, two favorite winter colors that I have right here are OPI Dim Sum Plum and China Glaze Seduce Me. And they're like not even winter colors because they're pretty bright. But if I wear like a pink, I'll wear one of these colors. Um, and in person, they're deeper. This is like a deep cranberry. And this is like a kind of muted raspberry. So, so I'm going to add a question. It's going to be favorite top coat. And that is Seshvit. 
and I'm also going to show you a few of my favorite polishes. My favorite polish for the toes is China Glaze um, for Audrey and also um, Mod About You by OPI, but I can't find that right now. Favorite pinks, this is this is like a pink purple and it is a Pandemonium Pink by OPI and this was a limited ed edition collection but I wouldn't be surprised if um, a place like Ulta still had it. I'm not sure if it's showing true to color but it's it's just kind of like a milky pinkish purple. This is my all-time favorite nail polish and also a pink and it is Essie High Maintenance and I've gone through countless amounts of these and I love this because of all the polishes I own this is the one that always looks best on me if I do it to myself. This is definitely a favorite. I love this polish. I highly recommend it. It is so like glossy and pretty. And another really neutral one that I love is by Zoya and it is Lucy. And this is just a perfect like French manicure color because it's really sheer but it's not too sheer. It definitely gives like a little bit of color. This is a great polish for work. And lastly I have this color by Chanel and it is 521 Rose Cachet. And I love this because it reminds me of a dupe for Essie Mirror Vixen. And it is just like a pink with... I don't know, just kind of a dispensed like mixture of iridescent purple and pink glitter, I guess. <laughs> I don't know, but those are some of my favorite nail polishes and that is my nail polish tag. So I tag everyone to do this video, but I will leave a few particular names down below. And in general, just tell me what your favorite color is for spring. Thanks, and I hope you like and subscribe to my channel if you want to see more videos. Bye.